Um, yeah, hello guys. Um, today I'm gonna show you my um, World War II gas mask collection. And that's, that's another mask over there, but I'm gonna show you first some new projects I got from the internet. The French invasion money. I'm happy with these ones, but not with these small ones. Yeah, they look alright, but from on the camera they look right they look right, alright, but this is an original one. An original French invasion money. Currents see French invasion money. But yeah, if you look at the difference these are all red lines and here that just a red red um background but yeah and those are all printed off from the internet from those websites but yeah I'm gonna go slide those on my bed for a second and we will start off with this one but first I'm gonna say gonna tell you None of this is for sale, that's my personal collection, and I'm um, really proud of it, so, yeah. <coughs> this is a Danish, or a Polish, or a Denmark, I, I don't know actually, but it looks at the British ones, because, oh, the only um, difference is, is this one, this little bar is, on the British ones, is shorter and more like that but yeah this um a British um a Danish gas mask or something somewhere I don't know that's a there's a really big filter yeah I got this at uh Bastogne in a museum I thought I'm oh, gonna buy this because I like it <laughs> the inside of the mask is um it's like a normal British one, like the inhale valve is over there, and the exhale and the speed diaphragm is in the middle. And next, I got a got a lot of Belgium masks. This is my Engelbert, um, Engelbert, and that's. Another one I got, I got earlier, this one, and that's the un unused one, that's a used one, but yeah, these look like the same, um, yeah, I have done a review on that, on my new stuff thing, uh, video, this is an L702, also Belgium, these are made by thousands, and that's a canister, and I got four of those. I got one, two, three, four over here. And yeah, these are. I got some extra lenses and um, um, uh, the manual. In canister, and the inside is really simple. But yeah. That's a good mask. And next is another Belgium one. That's a little rare one. Um, yeah, on the inside we got a sponge like that, and the inhale and the exhale is in the piece. But yeah, I really like this mask because it got this, this really big. Hat flap or for the straps. But yeah, that's the filter. Also, a really big, uh, big uh, filter, and that's the container. And we've got an extra inhale valve right there. Yeah. Then moving on to my Sussex. This is a really nice mask. I, re I really like this one because it's um, made of really thin rubber and wait a second 
And also, the belt for in and on axle is the same as that one. So it's got like this now. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, that's that. The nail axle. So, um, yeah, that's this one. I got another one, size 1, and that's size 2, or no, no, that's size 1 and size 2. Then, moving on to French. This is a French gas mask it's a really fragile mask really stiff and if you hurt or listen the fabric like this is a World War II of course um it's uh I don't I forgot the name but yeah um also this is one the guy where I bought it from thought that it wasn't a uh, American one, but it's a, it's a French. Yeah, is the exhale and the inhale is in this in this little tube. It's a really strange mask. When I first saw it, it was like, whoa, that's a really nice mask. And yeah, the in it, the inside of it, it's yeah, that's that. Be careful. Yeah, that's the inside of it. To be really careful. Yeah, that's the inside. You can see how how strange that is with the canvas and the rubber. Yeah, be careful. That's the canister. This is a other French gas mask. And this one, the lenses are condensed, but not just to rip it out, but just really white. I don't know why, but yeah. The filter is, um, I don't know. The filter is not right on this one, but yeah, it's just, um, this, I really, I also really like this one. It smells it smells nice. I got some nice straps. The bag. This is a French gas yes, mask bag. This um, mask came in the bag. It's for this mask, but with a hose and a bigger filter. Yeah, that's a really nice bag. Then um, a Russian mask. That's a really strange one. This. This strange one, it's rare. I never actually seen one before on those gas mask websites, and so these are the goggles. And that's the top, it's uh, Russian, so yeah. It's this mount piece, inhale, exhale, and a nose clip. Yeah, that's uh, really nice. Then moving on to my British one. This is a British civil defense. Oh, oh, um, a civil civil gas mask. The only sad thing about this is is this really big crack in the, in the screen. The front. Yeah, this uh, this is it's a little bit annoying, but yeah, it's who cares? It's World War Two. Um, yeah, that's a filter, that's a one-use mask, and that's a really simple inhale, actually no exhale, but yeah. Um, and this is just a, the box, not the original box, but just the placement. I'm moving on to my American gas mask. It's actually my only American gas mask. This, wait a minute, M3A, uh, A1, oh yeah, this M3 just, it's an M3 gas mask that you already seen those in my other videos. That's an original one. 
still need to find me a real one. And I have to stop. It's gonna be a second part up, and so, uh, yeah, see you later.